today brings us to the Lakeland Antique Mall. We've seen a lot of things in here that they have like some really good Disney props. So we're gonna go see what they've got Disney wise, but we both love antique malls anyway. Mm -hmm. So it's might really find, fun. yeah, might find something else that's pretty cool. So let's go check it out. We got Lowe's over here, Chuck E. Cheese's, and the antique mall. Now, Get some pizza. Go play some, get some coinage with the. There you go. Probably yeah. all digital now or something. Uh -huh. I haven't been in I don't know how many years, but I don't know. I'm hoping they've got some really good Disney stuff. I know they normally do. They post about it all the time. But again, I just like looking at all the old antique stuff. Their hours are 10 to 7 every day besides Sunday, and that's 10 to 6. Right away, we're greeted with fall decor and this cool little car nice at the front counter look at all of these they've got the one two three four five six they've got the seven doors some snow globes oh look they've got star trek more disney items they've got several containers of disney pins look at the whoa this is a game changer you know we do a lot of pin trading so i'll put that uh, video in the corner and in the description of us doing some pin trading, but they've got a bunch here Wow I mean Container after container of Disney pins They've also got some pins over here in a little display case And down below some more Disney items <laughs> There's the, look, Haunted Mansion. Over here they have a lot of things. Look at this, Pirates of the Caribbean, the Enchanted Tiki Room, the Haunted Mansion. Look at this Walt and Mickey statue. So we're gonna start over at the right hand side and start looking through some of these booths. Now there's no way possible I can film everything Disney in here because wherever you turn, look, Disney, 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 but pretty cool item so far. Over in this display case, look at the huge Lilo and Stitch set. $1,700. And then hiding back here is a Splash Mountain shirt, which that's gonna be worth something someday, but right now it's worth $125. Come across another pin set. There's gonna be some <laughs> Yeah. I can find some pretty cool ones. Look at this Steamboat Willie puzzle poster. $30, that is, that's neat. To go along with the fall Halloween theme, look at the Jack Skellington massive pumpkin head. I love that. That is really cool. And then some Mickey Halloween items. Look at this, Haunted Mansion. I know that. And a magic band. <laughs> now we're kind of back over here on the right hand side and we're going to start doing laps down each of the aisles. But like literally there's just so many items in here. It's, it's pretty unreal. Also, if you like uh, Beanie Babies. Oh, look. Well, oh, Alien. They have a bunch of them. I mean, this is just one little section, but they've got some really old school looking ones, like Jungle Book, Aladdin's back there. Really neat. That's cool. So we finally made it down the first aisle. So that was all the things just in one aisle. There's some furniture back here. And now we start going in between. Um, I guess, well, where is the go through this little section and then down the aisles now. And then here's the overview of the aisles. So you can see now we're gonna start going this way, working our way down. But I mean, this is a huge antique mall, huge. Now, one thing I do is I collect Pez sets and different- Line of the <laughs> Pez's, and they've got quite a bit of Pez's here. So maybe I'll be able to find one that I want and get it. 
I know we keep showing the pins, but look, they've got some variety packs here. Is that a, that's a watermelon one. That's cool. So like for $19, you can get a variety pack. This little guy, he moves. <laughs> and then of course, just dig through all of them and look at all of these little figurine things. Good grief. Just kind of for a waypoint, there's the front entrance. So now we're going down this one. I think this is what, aisle three, essentially. Yeah. And we'll see how long it takes us to look in here. But I, I mean, you could spend some major time. Yeah, there's, I mean, there's stuff that we don't necessarily spend the time looking at that right. other people probably would. Yeah, I mean, some of these we just pass through, but there, there's, there's a lot of good finds. Plenty to yes. Look at. Something that we just found is look at this Jerry West uniform, for five hundred fifty dollars, Hall of Famer. Wow. That is unreal. Since we're over at the sports section here, they've got a Magic Johnson signed basketball for $175. You see, we're getting ready to head down another aisle. They've got some ornaments and guess what? More pins. Hey, there's the Serbian that we have. Oh, I like that. That's my favorite one. Is that like Olympics or something? Yeah, that's nice. Yeah. This is my booth, Steamboat Willie. Look at that. Yeah, I was gonna say, then look at the Pirates of the Caribbean. Oh, it's $600 though. That is cool. I don't... Rare Pirates of the Caribbean shadow box. <laughs> look at all these down here though. Oh, look at the hitchhiking ghost down at the end. <laughs> yeah, that's neat. So this is really crazy. I actually own one of these, but it's not still in the package. A Turbo Man doll from Jingle All the Way still in its original package. I think it says it's $75. Now we're heading down. What, this might be the halfway point, I don't know. It's, it's, a, it's a very large store. So we're gonna start picking up the pace a little bit just because we've been here. Not Quite... digging through every single sports car. What? Cool. We found some good ones in there though. Over on this side, they've got a ton of toys. Holy smokes. Toys, 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 toys. Pirates. Got some action figurines up there. Pez sets. More Pez sets. If you collect any sort of cards, we've seen quite a bit of cards in here. So pretty cool. In fact, I might've snagged a couple to buy, which we can show you when we're all said and done, but even more. Ooh, 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 ooh. We're gonna dig in here. We have found all the model vehicle section. So many. Both sides, really. Over here at the art corner, they have a bunch of Disney stuff. Got the Seven Dwarfs, Snow White. Look at these lamps. All of these, oh, these are really cool. Drawings. Yeah, this is a cool section here. Look at the Walt Disney World Main Street Emporium Snow White window display for $26,000. You could have the whole window display. And here you go, sure. certificate of authenticity. And over here, more Disney. They do have quite a bit of Barbie items. Hey, more cards. Dumbo. Okay, this section's really neat. They have all of these action figures. And I mean, a bunch, right? Turn this way, action figures. Turn this way, action figures. Over here, action figures. Oh man, I wanna buy them all. This is, this is insane. Oh, they have pirates things. Now I do have quite a bit of pirates action figures, so I need to go through those and see if there's any that I don't have, but I mean, look. Action figures. Everywhere you turn, action figures. This is, this is nice. Look at this. Look, Splash Mountain. <coughs> Haunted Mansion, those are cool. And then look at this. Which is it though? 290? Mm. Look at this Disney desk. Cool. And then over here in the corner. Mm. 
Yeah. Oh, well, yeah. And then, look, Patton. Be your own hero. All right, here's what's left of the, whoa. Speaking of Halloween Horror Nights, look, Halloween Horror Nights game. Disney and Universal props sold here. Okay, this is gonna be, this is gonna be a nice section because if you look, um, here are all the props. We're gonna have to dig in here. And right here, look, look, Disney Spring Christmas d display prop. That's $1,500. Universal Studios Men in Black prop. That's really neat. The Haunted Mansion promo poster. This is, this is, this is, I mean, everywhere you turn. This is like Toy Story. Oh yeah, it might say, everywhere you turn, oh, pirates. <gasps> oh, but it's the Mardi, Mardi, Gras. Mardi Gras. Look at all these. Oh, that's scary, but Halloween Horror Night stuff. This is unreal. Look at these. Are these the popcorn buckets? Popcorn bucket. Popcorn bucket. The Epcot Flower and Garden bench. Animal Kingdom Lodge rocking chair. Did we figure out what this big thing's from? Just no. Say. I don't know. It does look like Toy Story, though. It has to be. Animal Kingdom Rivers chair. Animal Kingdom Lodge. Pirate statue prop. That's pretty cool. On the Disney Cruise. Yeah, that's really neat. Animal Kingdom prop. Wilderness Lodge prop. Oh, look at that. That's in the Caribbean Beach Resort. Look at the posters. Pop Century. Th that's, that's unreal. What's that? Oh, the spring? Oh, that is cool. More over here. Hollywood Studios table. <laughs> and Can You Feel the Love tonight is playing in the background, so that's that's fitting. Hey, look at that. Yeah, I mean, these are pricey items, $500. Of course, all these chairs that are from something. <clears throat> Look at the ornaments. Yeah. Oh, and then this village. That's really neat. And then the castle. Look at this Mr. Toad 70th anniversary figure. Flower and Garden Festival from Epcot. And this is really pretty amazing over here they've got California Adventure map flubber Disney dollars okay we're about to round out the last few aisles this little side looks nice because I've noticed what's this Pirates of the Caribbean oh it's a puzzle I actually have that puzzle but it's in a box I don't I didn't put it um, completed hey what do you think about that? Oh my gosh. Terrifying. <sighs> we went to that in one of the videos. It was it was very strange. So you found what'd you find? I, I, I don't really know. Set of three film real tins. Huh. Hollywood Mega Store. That's pretty interesting. There's more props back here. That's from uh, Norway. Norway Pavilion. You can see they've got all these more props. Phone? 
<laughs> That's funny. I haven't seen those in a while. I still have one, but Furbies. Oh, that's a, I had a red one. What'd you have? I had a red one. Purple. Purple. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Mine kind of blew up. Oof. Florida orange. Old books, you and your old books. Not just any books. You and any book. For $750, you can get Beauty and the Beast. Ginormous statue. Hey, look at the, look at the Lion King. It's pretty neat. We got the toy store. Not as many toys as I've seen at some of the other, other ones. And it looks like we've just got two more, two more aisles left. And that is a very, very, very large for four hundred fifty dollars, Mickey. And then over here is more. God, look how old these Disney items are. What else you got? Oh, name tags. Now something I noticed is behind us there is more Disney props. We have to go check out this way. Disney props. Look at this Superman movie street prop for two thousand five hundred dollars. Over here they have All-Star Resort hangers. They've got All-Star Resort tables. Walt Disney's home. Oh, Marceline. Oh yeah, we went and visited that. It was cool. You can see all these props as well. That's a cool sign. Whoa, look at this. $4,500. A puppet theater. What in the world? Animal Kingdom Light. I don't know what this big thing is. Oh, is it? It looks like, is this something that was on the um, 25th anniversary. Yeah. You got these guys here. And you have all the Winnie the Pooh stuff. Is that like from the ride? No, I think you used to be able to go into Winnie, Winnie the Pooh's house, I think. Oh, and that's what it's from? Yeah. Gotcha. It, that's gotta be, is that, it's a small world. What is that? Oh, I don't, I will not be touching. Look at that. What is that? Man, this is unreal. These tickets, Magic Kingdom tickets. Pillows. This is kiosk merchandise kiosk. I mean, that's pretty unbelievable. All the stuff they have over there. All right, and now, oh, they've got. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, that yeah. Big Winnie the Pooh. Look at this. Pen set, look at this. And then we finally made it to the last aisle. I have to say. <laughs> you're digging out snacks? It's just, I haven't seen anything quite like this. Especially if you're a Disney fan. Now the cool thing is they have other things than just Disney, but they do have a plethora of Disney items. All right, we made it around the corner. We did get a few things. They actually have a hold table up here. I'll show you that you can just set your items on because we did get a few things. So um, 
I actually wanted to get a bunch of things, but we were like, oh. I don't know what that is, but that's pretty cool. So right here is where you can hold all your items. So we have a few items here that we held over here, so we didn't have to carry them around. Something else we noticed is each aisle is labeled. It goes from A all the way to J. And to show you our haul, in here it's wrapped up, but I sent a picture of my dad. It's a Spock Star Trek like figurine thing. He collects those. Then he also wanted this. I've never seen this before. A Men in Black Jeeps action figure. Rotating heads. Then bought some basketball cards because I collect those still. You got the a Light in the Attic poem yeah. book yeah what's this one Wuthering Heights. and then here are the two disney pins we got those will not be traded but they had a big like the smaller ones and they had a lot of disney pins yeah. so pretty good haul holy smokes i am tired and hungry how long have we spent in there a while two hours at least i don't know, I don't know but that was awesome that was probably the that was probably the best antique store I've ever been in. That was cool. um, especially if you're a Disney fan. Ton of Disney stuff. It was cool because they did have other items as well. Um, but again, mostly Disney and some really rare, cool Disney things. I enjoyed it. You liked all the books. Yeah. I had a ton books. of books. But yeah, it's right here in Lakeland. Um, if you're ever out in the area, stop by because it's worth it's worth going. And like you mentioned earlier, maybe bring a snack because or eat before because you're going to be stuck in there pretty much looking at everything but great time loved it and with that being said that does it for today thanks for watching